Shiny Squirtle here, bringing you another um, episode in my quest to beat this um, battle mason, and I'm here joined by, um, joined by, okay, so here we are going to be going through and beating the single um, battle one, as I've tried before, but I did end up failing, I think I don't have any streak. I was trying like off. Can tell, I am gonna be wrecking a Gengar with Calm Mind Sweeper. Oh. Okay. So now we're gonna be using the Battle Box team, and how should we lead this? We went over the, some strategies earlier. Um, do we lead Clef Key to get defenses set up for um, Age of Slash or Greninja, depending on what we see coming in? Because I know. Um. Um, Swords Dance, King Shield, Sacred Swords, Shadow Sneak. Um, yeah, um, Should we lead, um, Clef Key to get dual screens and paralysis up so that... But another thing I could recommend with your Clef Key is that, um, you, um, remove, remove all of its moves. You put Swagger, Thunder Wave, Foul Play, and Substitute. Well... I generally like the dual screens better just because it gives me extra defense and has saved me a couple games. I believe um, once off camera, it's um, it left me with one hit point after I got dual screen set up on like a sweeper, kind of like in the um, multi battle earlier today, which I'm uploading into my channel. What? Yeah, FFA. In the free for all. I had a um I had um I don't remember what Pokemon it was, but um it was the one where Scorpio earthquaked and killed that Pokemon. Yeah, that was one hit point survival and I was like, Yes no. Yeah, like, I ended up with plus one. <laughs> so, here we go. Our first match is up against a hiker. Should be a decent one for either one to come in and sweep. Um, we're going uh, up against a basil. Oh, no. Um, a basil. Kind of like, um, the herb, I think. Because most of the names in here seem like puns. Okay, let's just get Reflect Light Screen up. Okay, wait. Put your camera on and show me the Pokemon. Um, we're going up against a Shuckle. But... Oh, okay. And at least it used, um... It shared its power with me. Um, I don't know, um... Um, the ones I ran into have had, um... Um, I don't exactly know the easiest way to, like, trick. angle this. And, um, the, the okay, I've got Reflect up. <laughs> can you see it too good from there? Yeah, I can, yeah. Uh, okay. Kind of an awkward angle, because I'm going to have to keep grabbing down in front of the screen to, like, move the circle pad. Oh, great, now we're locked into light screen. You know what I'm going to do? Yeah, no. I'm going to. I'm just going to slap the, the in the face. Sorry, Bill. Um... Oh. Let's just run. Let's just go Aegislash and set up. Well, no, because it encores you. Oh, well, that just means we'll get to plus four. Oh, he was trying to trap me with Sand Tomb. Really? You're trying to Sand Tomb? No, he ran into a Sand... He, he used Sand Tomb, which already activated my um weakness policy as soon as I brought an Aegislash. But he... Yeah, he was trying to trap me in because I was on cord into the light screen, which really won't do too much. Oh no, he's gonna split my attack. Um, if I switch to um, by the way, do you know the way um EVs with um, it just slash work? Like, if I invest in the attack, will it stay as attack when he goes into sword form? Or will it switch to defense? I don't know. I think if you have defense, it goes into the uh, offense when you switch form. Yeah, like, 
I really thought mine would be getting a lot more KOs because I went max attack, max. Um. Oh. When you change your form, check your stats. Um, I know I have like um 200 or so attack. Um, and changes its form. I have 201 attack and 57 attack, um, defense in, um, sh non shield form, in sword form. Um, do you want me to, can, do you, do you need the, um, video from the battle, or do you just. Or do you trust me to t not joke around with you about uh, seeing legendaries on, like, Battle 2? Oh, <laughs> yeah. No, I just started now. This is Battle 1, and we are going for Shadow Sneak now. Because he's at, he's in red health, and we are at plus four. But our attack is split with the shuckle, so I'm not sure. Oh, yes, we got the knockout. You know, shuckle with full HP investment only has 96 HP at level, um, 50? Um. Okay, no, I didn't know that, but let's just go for another shadow sneak, because I'm sure yeah. this Doug Drio is just going to earthquake and kill me. Um, oh, no, hung on by its focus sash. Phew. Oh, hey, Doug Trio. If you didn't know, I had King Shield to deal with Dig. You're at one hit point, you're underground, so you're gonna make physical contact on this turn, so I just go. I, um, King Shield, so he's gonna lose half his damage. And then he's at one hit point, I have Shadow Sneak. Oh, he has protect. Yay! So he's gonna stall this battle, this part out one turn longer. Um, I'm gonna take away the face cam, okay? Um, on the Skype call. Okay. Here we go. So now this time it gets t taken out. Um, by the way, I only have a 15 minute really um like span on these videos, so we might have to. And after like one battle, but then again, this was kind of like the first video, just to like we were introducing what who we were, like um who who I was being joined with and who, what pokes we were going to be using. But this one we can just come. Oh, um. Well, we were calling before this to talk over strategies. Um, I'm only at about 8 minutes 30 seconds on the video, actually. Are you serious? Yeah. Let's just do two battles then, because, like, I'm, I'm halfway done mine. Yeah, because, like... A basil's gone now. I believe that was his name, at least. <laughs> I'm, I, it's hard to pronounce some of their names. Like, I'm not sure, but there's always a guy named Lung in every generation, it seems. Like, one of the guys in Chuck's gym was named Lung in um, Heart Gold Soul Silver. Um, there was a ninja boy named Lung somewhere around. That, and... A guy named Knob, I believe, is always in the game as well. So, here we go. Battle number two. I believe this is a Polka fan. Um, one of, the, um, yep, Polka fan Olano. Ooh, leading with Golem. This might actually be one that we can. Um, what? Wait, there's an order that the, the trainer's classes are? 
Oh no, I'm just saying that we end up facing a, um, we ended up facing a, um, a polka fan at, for Battle 2. I'm just saying that, because I saw the trainer class outside of Battle, and I recognized them from doing this so much. So we had a, I'm just saying that that's the order we got. I'm not saying it's the end-all order. And... Should we pa should we go? Th oh no, wait! We can't paralyze this guy. We can't paralyze a rock. Well, no, what? You can paralyze rock types. No, because most of them, including this one, happen to be part ground type. Yeah, I'm saying, but rock types, pure rock types, can be paralyzed. Yeah, it would just be a waste of your effort because they are already as slow as rocks. For I have no clue what reason. They're as slow as rocks. What? I said because Golem's a rock. Yeah. And now he's making himself even slower by cursing. Yeah, but raises attack and defense. And lowers speed. Mm -hmm. So he's just making himself more vulnerable to my foul plays on my Klefki. Yeah, but it, no, it does the same amount of damage because his defense goes up. Oh, yeah. Imagine if foul play ignored defensive stats, but it used their offensive stats. Well, I guess we're going to end the video when you're done your battle, right? Um, well, I was thinking just record a couple now, so I have some coverage to go up during the week while I'm at school. Oh, I'm on my, um, are you on your, um, spring break? Um, no, not yet. But I... Yeah, my, um, spring break is in April. Really? But I do get, but I do get Fridays completely off, though. Every week? Yep, every week, pretty much. Unless it's, like, a snow day or we're making up from a snow day or holiday. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, and now it's Taurus. I'm pretty sure Taurus should have enough, um, attack to break its own substitute, but I'm not sure. Yeah, it does. Okay, yeah. Yeah, like, there weren't any, like, sword stances into that, so I wasn't 100% sure. Oh, it's gonna try and endure. Oh, well. It goes oh, for... The That's, like, the worst, like, combination of moves, like... Why do they always go for substitute endure? Like I mean, you're... no, it does end up breaking the sub. Yeah, endure just means that you can't kill them. Like the actual Pokemon won't go down that turn, but they're behind sub and they always endure for some reason here in the battle, Mason. So here we go, sock. Our last Pokemon is a sock, which means. Um, I don't. I think I saw reflect go down, so I'm gonna just set up reflect again. Oh, I missed reflect. Ooh, oh, retaliate! Oh, that's gonna oh, knock me out. Oh, oh man, as soon as I um. Okay, so who should we go for? Oh, no. Age of Slash or Greninja against um Sock. Oh, yeah, I was saying how that might not be 100% of the time. Well, most of the time it is. Yeah, like, I mean, maybe if the mom gets a crit, the baby has a higher chance to crit. Probably. That might be how it goes. But, like, if the mom doesn't get a crit... Oh! Wow! Taunting the Greninja! They just taunted our fully offensive Greninja. Wow. Like, our Greninja brings him down to almost one hit point, the sock, and he decides to use this one turn to taunt us and not to, like... Protein on that, right? Yeah, protein. But I was using Surf anyway, so it wasn't really, like, the only oh, thing... Oh, you your dark type, I yeah, like, that's the only thing. Yeah, like... It's important. Yeah, like, the only thing that he could have done differently would have been, like, 
to taunt, um, torment me, I mean, and then make me ha have to go to, like, ice typing or dark typing. Or I could have just grass nodded him. Yep. So I will see you guys in the next video, because we have just about run out of time. And I will see you guys in that next video. Bye!